uh, patients and, and, and scientists as well have to bear in mind that our experience with the virus is four months old. The overall advice is that cancer patients are more vulnerable than the general population to a varying degree according to their uh, therapies. And we advise that uh, they uh, become informed about this disease and they contact their doctors and their cancer institutions for specific advice in order to protect themselves. Some cancer patients who have had uh, intense chemotherapy or a bone marrow suppressing chemotherapy regimens may need to abide by more strict self-isolation measures. But this is not a guidance for the, for the general cancer patient population. Cancer care is not going to be stopped. This is important for the patients to realize. The question here and the discussion we're having is, which are the optimal adaptations that we need to implement so as to protect the health personnel who is dealing with cancer and the patients with cancer? So it is likely that some follow-up appointments, some radiology appointments will have to be rescheduled. We're going to use telemedicine and uh, telephone visits in order to talk to the patients, in order to review their examinations and to uh, reassure them, um, inform them about the course of their disease and of course prescribe oral medication. Our patients should trust us and they should trust the healthcare decision makers. We fight a pandemic but at the same time we want to continue being able to care for our patients with cancer.